perfect little mushroom. <laughs> it's so cute. Sun is coming up. Sky's lighting up. The forest is still really dark. The moon is still out though. It's right over there. A little yellow thing. Which I think actually last night it was the full moon. So it's actually pretty bright hiking. Wow. The forest is so beautiful. But I think I still need my headlamp on. Good morning, everybody. It's day 138 and it's already a great day. <laughs> so I left my shelter this morning and, well, actually I slept quite terribly, actually. Uh, there were like just tons of mosquitoes and I ended up like putting my quilt on and then also like slept with my bug head net over my face. And I woke up sweaty because I had my quilt on. So it was not a great night's sleep, but that's okay. I woke up this morning um, and did some night hiking because we're headed to Upper Goose Pond Cabin today, I think it's called. And it's like a pond where you can swim and um, we're probably going to tent there. But there's also like a cabin that I think has free bunks in it and they also serve breakfast in the morning so that's super exciting and so basically i'm just trying to maximize my time chilling at the pond today and swimming so that's why i woke up this morning to night hike i think they're i think it's about uh 17 16 17 miles to the pond so it is quite a ways um but that's, again, why I got such an early start. And the sunrise. Look, it just came up. So. It's going to be a good day. And I'm going to sleep better tonight. I am definitely not sleeping in another shelter until it starts cooling off for good. Because I forgot how bad the mosquitoes were. And it was bad. <laughs> that's okay, though. I'll make it. Looks like I may be in a cloud this morning. <laughs> Not great visibility, but I love the vibe. Looks like somebody's been putting in the work. Check out this spider web. Huh, it's kind of hard to see. Let me see what the best angle is. Oh yeah, <laughs> wow. That's cool. The little farmhouse over there is so pretty in the morning fog. A bench! What a pleasant surprise. We love a bench. And even more than that, we love a bench with a view. That's not too bad, eh? A bench and a picnic table. What a day, folks. What a day. <laughs> and spectacular views. This is so refreshing to see. Look at that, somebody's got fire over there. 
Wow, this is so beautiful. I love New England. <laughs> I feel like I'm just like really getting into the change of forest and this is so great. Check out this tree. It is huge and this like branch is bigger than most of the trees out here. Wow. That is so stunning. All right, just got to this road crossing. There's a sign for a trail stand, snacks and soda. And I can see it from here and it looks so cute. So I'm gonna go check it out. Look how adorable. So cute. Let's see, fresh eggs. Soda, Gatorade, candy chips, pop tarts, cookies. That's awesome. This is such a good idea. Purple little wildflowers and such a cute little twisty turvy boardwalk. And just a magical view. I'm telling you folks, I am in awe of the trail today. This is just, I don't know, rejuvenating me and bringing life back to my hike, I feel like. It's so beautiful, like everything I've seen today, I'm just like, wow, this is all just so stunning. Some more cool little spider webs over there. This boardwalk is so cute. I apologize if I'm saying so cute so much, but it really is. So I'm not sorry. A little bit of unexpected trail magic. We got some bananas and some water. And a cute little garbage trail that's so cute. And Upper Goose Pond Cabin, that's where I'm heading today, only seven more miles. He walks like <laughs> <laughs> the ladies in the office at school. <laughs> Howdy guys, so I'm wrapping up for day 138. It's currently day 139. Uh, but yesterday afternoon, got to the upper goose pond cabin and honestly i was just so exhausted from not sleeping well the night before in the shelter and then obviously waking up in like night hiking and did about 17 miles and got there at like 2 p.m which is like pretty crazy for me like that is definitely a lot faster than my average pace um but I wanted to have a full day just to kind of like chill at the pond. And so once I got to the cabin, I got set up and literally just relaxed in the water and laid around all day and just relaxed. And it was so nice and so lovely, but unfortunately I forgot to like take videos because obviously we were going swimming, so I didn't bring my phone and whatever, it's fine. But. Yeah, so uh, be sure to check back to tomorrow's video to see what the plan is for today. I think I might stop by the infamous cookie lady. So it's just a teaser for tomorrow. So, all right, I'm gonna get to it and I'll talk to you guys later.